Hello, Bethel Park Gamers. I hope you enjoyed gaming this weekend. My name's Anthony Veltri. Welcome to all new episode of Bethel Park Gaming. The return of Ethan and Colin with his collection of what? Skylanders. You're very excited about this, aren't you? One of my favorite games growing up, honestly. And this is the very first. Yes, the very first game in the series. Is that all 32? Yes, it is. Would you like to show them? Okay, well, to be honest, some of them are their Giants counterparts, their season they're season two characters. They're the ones with the orange bases that you could probably see. Uh, for example, uh, Eruptor here. This is his series two, one with an orange base, as you two can see. Uh, the other things I have here are the adventure packs and their adventure items. Yeah, Health Potion, Anvil Rain, uh, Ghostly Swords, uh, Time Hourglass. I don't recall what half of these are. I literally just, to be honest, out of all the collection, the stuff I literally just got are the front three adventure packs. There are items except for these two, which came with Darklight Crypt, which, which I've had ever since the first game came out. Yeah, it took me this long to get them. And again, you're very excited to do this. So much. Let's get to it, folks. Oh, back in this game now, boy. Let's take it, bro. How do you have 22? 17? Oh, yeah. Who's <laughs> judging? Yeah. Yes! Here comes Banana Slammer. It's meme time. <laughs> Boy! Oh, 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 oh my oh, gosh! No! A little drum music, if you please. Flap uh, the wings, burning! There! Flap the wings! There it is. What's one? Oh, this is gonna show you fun! Oh, you got fun! Yeah! Yeah! You got yeah! Yeah! Yes! Yes! Greetings, young portal master. I have been waiting for you. I am Eon, your guide in this world. But where are you, you may ask? This is Skylands, an ancient world of wonder and mystery. For generations, the Portal Masters and the Skylanders kept peace and balance in this world so that all creatures could thrive. Magic flows through everything here. Every rock, every tree, and every beast. But now our world is in great danger. The darkness is spreading. Skylands needs your help. A great adventure awaits you, young Portal Master. I have sent my assistant Hugo to seek you out. We will speak again soon. But yes, as those of you watching have heard, that was Eon. He is our guide in this world. And our job is to stop the spreading darkness. Which is actually sentient, but we only find that out in the fourth game. Wowzers, look at all these oh. balloons oh leaving. God, right. yes. Yes. It's going to be a snap. And supercharges. Oh. Yes, those of you heard, that is Patrick Warburton. First, the core explodes. Then, I start hearing voices. And now, I'm in the middle of a village being ripped apart by who knows what. Clearly, I am losing my mind. The reason we're doing this in December is because this was always when I, Christmas was the only time I'd always get my a new Skylanders game, except Superchargers. I had to buy that later because we were going to Florida that year, sadly. So, in honor of this being in, me in being relation to me first playing the game, I'm putting on the first character I played with. Quick fun fact, in this game, he won't, he won't say the name of every Skylander. He only says the name of the three that came in the starter pack, being Trigger Happy, Spyro, and Gil Grunt. If you put anyone else on, he'll just say, whoa, a Skylander. Okay, as you can see, we're both level three, but I, like, as I've already told these two, I'm not resetting any of them for this playthrough. I've reset them a dozen times. Hold up, Anthony, you yeah, know I what we gotta show the them. Yeah, this is a secret cutscene, honestly. I'll meet you on the other side, side of the village. village. A balloon, balloon should be waiting for us there. If I don't float away too far away first. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you want to switch out to someone else, maybe? With this guy? Yeah, because I got a lot more money. Just give me any. Mmm, let's see. Who do I want you to try out first? Okay. Let's see. How about I give you... And even great, another great shooter character. I'll if you remember that. seeing any of the commercials, he was the one who was like, let's go, Skylander. And then this guy was set, telling him to blow up everything. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I can't hear you, because I got blown up. <laughs> His third attack will be he'll be able to shoot a pineapple mortar. Pineapple? Yeah, it causes a big explosion. And if you go down the bazooka upgrade path, it'll cause shrapnel to fly out in different directions. When Is it, it lands. somebody's pineapple? No, it's just this. Is it Spongebob? 
No. <laughs> yeah, 760 is a pretty high amount. I think I'll swap out for someone else too. Let's see. Who do I, ah, you know what? Since I just mentioned him. Oh yeah, Boomer. Boomer. <laughs> Bring the boom. As for those of you wondering, no, these are not pandas. They're called Mabuk. They're not even pandas. Well, I mean, if you look at their faces, they kind of look like it. They're a bunch of sloths. Actually, actually, to be honest, you're right. I just realized that they are sloths. <laughs> How have I never noticed that? Don't, oh, by the way, for those of you watching, no, we cannot one off the edge of the map. Invisible barrier. Meet the best NPC in this series aside from the main villain. You guys will get me who our main villain is a little bit later. Hmm, let's see, I want to think. Ah, here we go. I don't think I ever got to show this guy off to you guys during uh, practice. Meet Double, double trouble. trouble. As the wire is called Double Trouble. Give me a moment once this is done and I'll show you. This is why. He explodes. The soul gems will g grant grant a newer special ability or upgrade to an already, or powerful upgrade to an already existing ability, as well as. I don't want to do it. Okay, true. Oh yeah, for those of you looking at the portal, uh, for this prison break is a light core from the second game. Light core is in, light core is caused a big shockwave in the games that they're actually registered as light cores in, but since they didn't exist in this game, he doesn't do that. Okay, let's go. I was just waiting for you, so yeah. Oh, come on! <laughs> This game also has some funny moments like that, too. Oh, right. <laughs> what we're going to do is... <laughs> Whoa. 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 And ditches us. <laughs> what we're going to do is... <laughs> How the hell did you get over here? Magic. Uh, the, the third starter pack character, Go Grind. <laughs> I'm just impaling you. How the hell did that kill him? It was stuck in the rock and it somehow killed him. He killed himself. I guess I don't oh, know. Oh no, when it's stuck in the wall like that, it doesn't do any damage. That's the thing, though. That's that. I no! Guess. Ah. Wow, double kill in one rocket. Yeah. Hello, hello, uh, hello. Hey, now I have limited secondary attack. <laughs> That's the other thing. If you hit NPCs, they'll do this. I did it by accident and didn't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but still, that's one of the greater parts of this first day. Okay, I think we broke something because we shouldn't be able to move yet. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get yourself cut. Cut? Yeah, do you not see this up here? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I do. I do. Watch it. Watch we don't get ganked. Ow! I like, got ganked. He, like you just did. <laughs> yeah, even if you're walking to this nicely protected part here, you still get damaged. Hey, Colin, this is for you. The cheese. It's the cheese. Oh. Believe it or not, the other day on Thanksgiving, I actually got Dr Lego Jurassic World. Oh, very good. <laughs> yeah. Fun. I've already beaten all the story modes and already gotten all the different amber bricks that allow you to unlock the dinosaurs. When that tornado is right on top of us. It is I, Chaos. Long have I waited for this day to take my revenge. Soon you will all bow down before me. Chaos. K-A-O. Biggest disappointment coming up. Big disappointment coming up in five, four, three, two. One. This is our villain, everyone. <laughs> it's a midget. <laughs> For those who remember hearing me shout "Fear my giant" floating in an earlier episode, this is where it came from. <laughs> and I know it's not the you want fun. Wadi was so no. fun. Well, I, that, you got you thought that, that that's what I meant, and I don't blame you for thinking that. You suck. <laughs> I'ma think you suck. Point him off, pal. That guy didn't stand a chance. I mean, have you seen the size of Terrapin's hands? Yes, I've seen it. It's the size of a bowling ball. Wait. Oh, what the hell? No. Oh. No way. <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> this please uh, I think so I have to say about that we'll be right back oh. hello everybody uh sorry about the abrupt cut we kind of had some technical difficulties the thing froze up for some reason the game 
suddenly froze and we just had to unplug and replug in the Wii U. Yeah. Which that really Anyway, what happened at the end of that cutscene was the Corps of Light got exploded explained how the Skylanders got to Earth, pretty much. The end. And everyone died. The end. I'll prep the balloon for takeoff. What do you need to prep? <laughs> Sunburn. Okay, now one thing I want to at least see is this. Greetings, young portal master. The dragons, most ancient and wondrous, need your help. Go with the dragon knight Flavius to the island of Scalos. Help him free his king from the clutches of the undead dragon Vathic and restore him to the throne. Quickly. Sound the horn, and Flavius will carry you into the skies and off to the dragon's peak. Okie dokie. Oh! What? That is wake earlier than that's supposed to go down. Not only that, but that's not all. There's also one more thing I want to... I want to at least see the other one. We might as well get these up, done and on for the map right yep. now. Empire of Ice. Like. Greetings, young portal master. Haldor, the great northern wizard, needs your help. You must go with him at once to save his village of Gladablum, which is locked in the icy grip of endless winter by the evil ice ogres. Hurry, the empire of ice awaits. And that's opening early now. I didn't know that this would happen. Oh god, I Oh my god, we're oh, on. No. I can't swim! Greetings, young portal master. Your adventure now takes an unexpected twist to the pirate seas. Help the swashbuckling Jess Legrand rescue her people from the loathsome Captain Dreadbeard and his vicious sea dog pirates. Adventure awaits. Set sail to Plunder Island. Yes, uh -oh. we know. It's open. <sighs> okay. Alrighty. Wait, hold up. We're gonna have to put on. We're gonna have to put Dark Light Crypt on too. Yeah, that one has the most interesting intro, honestly. The crypt shows up, and then the skull just slams down on top of it. The ghostly denizens of the afterworld need your help. The undead are running amok. They are literally up in arms. You must find a way to restore their peaceful rest. Be brave. Your adventure in the Dark Light Crypt awaits. It's open. Hey, that doesn't really need to happen. Okay, thank God we're back up here. That takes years of practice and skill. I know. A man Shut up. <laughs> I'll scout from overhead. Meanwhile, you see if you can find her on the ground. Double Trouble changes the color of their wool temporarily. Water will cause their wool to short out. And lightning. <laughs> this enlarges now. Let's play soccer. Watch ya. Flame Slinger is a male. Yes, he's a boy. He's an elf. You mean he's a boy. <laughs> boy! <laughs> okay, I am back from, back from Brazil and reporting for duty. Okay, so, my, so lightning rods, lightning rods attacks, so lightning bolts, and su summon lightning from the sky. As I said, uh, his third attack will he'll basically just have an electric field around him that only gets an upgrade with his uh, soul gem, which is cleverly hidden in the level, by the way. I guess it is. It's hidden under destructible item. That's how. I had no idea it was even there until I accidentally destroyed that item one time and found a soul gem. Really? I believe I can fly. I can't <laughs> fly. <laughs> Stupid vermin, you made me look bad. Ooga, booga, booga, booga. <laughs> he used the speed. He's the best. Okay, let's stop this guy. The boy. The boy, my boy. Remember that one episode of Luigi's Mansion where we just kept making the boing noises while we were on our way back to the elevator? Yeah, I guess so. Bing, boing, bing, boing, 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 boing. We just, we had apparently lost our sanity by that moment, by that point. Some characters like Trigger Happy's secondary attack where he throws a golden save or a pot of gold or a stump smash's main attack. Uh, sheep will be flattened into a pancake. Oh no. And then just spring up no like like nothing happened. Okay. See? What did I tell you? Pancake! Uh, you wanna switch to a magic one maybe, Anthony? Well, give me a second. I'm just destroying people with my lasers. Trust me, one attack I wish Robot had is by holding down A. I wish that he had like a hyper beam blast from the lasers, honestly, but he doesn't. That's the sad thing. I wish he did, but he doesn't. Oh yeah, Terrafin can punch, do a combo, and do this. His third attack lets him spot many shucks, and if you press his uh, attack, his A button, he does a belly flop. Okay. Anyway, yeah. Which magic one do you want? Give me the magic. 
Double trouble, yes. That's a good magic. Okay, the, the neat thing is his uh, his primary attack, Eldritch Beam, actually homes in on enemies, meaning he'll immediately target an enemy if he's facing so if he's not facing exactly towards it, but anywhere towards it, it'll immediately just home in on, like just swap over to them instantly, attacking them. I like this idea. You doing a range, and I'm going to go up close and personal. Quickly, your people need you. <laughs> yes, we respect them. And trap him in a ditch. There we go, let's go. No, he can't stick his head out anymore. He is literally trapped. There's nothing underneath him. <laughs> I guess not. Well, if that, if that ground gives away there, he's gonna die. I have no idea what's at the bottom of Skylands, honestly. Either you'll fall into the infinite sky like abyss, or you'll eventually land on an island. Don't know. How the hell did that happen? <laughs> I don't know. Cutscene. Hey, Flynn. Hey, I found Callie, and uh, she's not half bad. <laughs> we gotta save her so she can get up with We? Sort of I I'm sorry, but you don't look like you're armed or anything. Except with an ego. I'm going in. Ah! I don't want to go. <laughs> you will and you do. Okay. Okay, uh, each element has its own different blast. Magic has magic blast. Life shoots watermelons. Water shoots water globs, fire shoots fireballs, air shoots uh, three bursts of uh, air. Uh, oh yeah. Undead shoots skulls, and earth shoots rocks. <laughs> yes, Ethan? I'm coming, hold your horses, boy. No, I don't want to. <coughs> I was about to ask what tech shoots. Yes, for Skylander, what of it? Get me out of this chicken outfit. <laughs> yep. <laughs> get me out, get me out, get me out of this chicken outfit! May appear, appear to be, be friendly, friendly, cuddly, cuddly piles, piles of fluff. <laughs> turn your turn back on them, and they, them <laughs> and they turn into wretched lint balls with beady little eyes. Fun fact, the idea of an evil sheep actually comes to fruition in Trap Theme, which our first trap of a villain, Sheep Creep. A heavily armed sheep. Heavily armed by, with cork guns. You know, since I did a lot, you get a shot, Ethan. Yeah, let him have a turn. Lamb chops, anyone? <laughs> <laughs> Is nope. he gonna master it? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Some heroes we are. Well, then again, these are the bad guys we're talking about, so yeah. Who says it's wrong to steal? It is so wrong. It isn't wrong if we're taking it from the bad guys, though. I mean, I have a point there. Oh, look out. Yeah. Oh, oh, bye-bye. Bye, I'm fine. Bye. I'm fighting that infinite abyss down there. Ah. You can destroy these, actually. See? Yep. I literally saw it with my own eyes. My own. My own. Here lies Scout. He ran fast and died. And my own. Suggestion. He ran fast. All right, it's time to do the cannon again. Ah, go. No. Ow, ow. It didn't like Give me out this chicken outfit. In single player, you just shoot from both turrets, but yeah, multiplayer. It's probably very cramped in there if you ask me. The only Family Guy episode I like it was, and then there were fewer. Oh yeah, it's that hour long, no, not an hour long, but an hour and a half long special. Good evening, anybody. James Woods. Finding my dad's favorite Disney villain, honestly, without a doubt, is Hades. He's, the f he's, he's our favorite. I am trying to kill this guy, and you are wearing his merchandise! <laughs> the panic's just sipping from the cup. He's like, thirsty? Ah! Just see the explosion in the background. Hey, hey, you only heard something interesting about Hercules. When Haney says it's halftime, it's literally the halfway point in the film. Yeah, Seriously? Right? Oh my yeah, god! Yeah. I never I knew that. I just learned that today. Oh. Well, good. Good, good job for you. And also for you. That made that part, that made that even funnier, honestly. Oh, oh yeah. Right. Hi, have fun in Brazil. <laughs> you know what? I know what's down there. Brazil. <laughs> Imagine I if like we it. Are I just turn around. Place. I know what's down there. Brazil. <laughs> I just turn around perfectly. I have no idea how they're actually flying these. Whether if they're just flying magic drones or what they are, because you don't see a pilot in them, honestly. They're giant air balloons. Well, yeah, but I don't know. Are they being controlled mechanically or? Is there an actual pilot in them? That's the thing. That's not a pilot, that's just a single eyeglass thing. Well, you never know if somebody's inside of it. Eh, well, 
unless it's like a camera viewing thing because there is tech both like advanced technology and stuff this isn't just like a magical fancy world with just like knights and magic there's tech too in this series i mean hello you've seen the stuff you, you probably i mean look at drill sergeant for example oh yes i went for this one okay give me one hold up hold up ethan save some for me save some for me watch this good job here comes the baby uh yep the baby will attack and do some upgrade it can fly and then her uh soul gem ability Ooh. all boom if i roar at one it causes a little sound up wave to go around it but i'm going to be switching out from her here because as we saw she's fully leveled and i'm not resetting her trust me it's best that we at least keep some of these guys at the same level exactly yeah this is special for you well no because that's the correct level you want to be at for the final one and trust me that final level is hard with low level skylanders i guess so right oh well, yeah because the halfway point to where you set the final battle of chaos all knocked out skylanders from the part of just getting to it are returned to normal are, are he fully healed okay i got you i got you okay so how uh how she works is if i'm not mistaken give me a moment can i bounce them off yet no that's an upgrade okay but yeah, an upgrade she can get is if she blasts one of these, it'll shoot off another rainbow thing she launches. That ache move kind of reminds me of uh, Yoshi's smash attack. What move? Uh, Yoshi's uh, up special attack. When Yoshi oh, the, throws egg. the egg. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It didn't always it didn't always have the rainbow tail on it. That's why I was confused by that. Oh yeah, because I don't think you I saw it. Done that that okay, uh, hold, hold up, Ethan. Uh, nah. No, nah, don't do that. You want to go Okay, back? so quickly go down this way, and here we go. Fun fact, some Skylanders actually have connected histories. As a matter of fact, the reason why I'm explaining this is because we have a character with connected uh, histories right now. Drill Sergeant, originally, he is from a lost, uh, he is from a lost civilization called the Archeans. He is an Archean drill robot. He was found one day, deactivated, but it was reactivated by Terrafin. Ter Terrafin's one request of him that he never call that Jill Sergeant never call him master, and that is something Jill Sergeant still does to this day. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. That is his origin story. Speaking of which, I just realized. You know what? Screw the elemental bonus. Let's do this. <sighs> yes, you got your Terrafin. All right, guys. It seems like you're almost at the home stretch. Get me out of here. It's like nom. No, seriously, the area reminds me of that one Mario Party minigame. You know, bu the Bullet Bill Hell. Yes. <laughs> we got clouds underneath us. We're on. We're on castle-like surface. <laughs> God it's, help me. I think it's called uh, bu ballistics. Yeah. Welcome to Dawn, boys. <laughs> yes. Actually, we are going to be going through a war zone later in this game. I'm oh. not kidding. We're going to be going through trenches. I'm not lying. And a future episode, folks, you hear it from here. Oh, you are going to love that. Oh. We're, go we're going to war, boys. We're going to war. Come on, darn it. Oh. Yep, Where am I aiming? <laughs> Ethan's doing all the work here. I'm uh, yeah, Colin, you're yellow. Oh. Yeah, I know. I'm shooting all over the place. All right, heavy ship. There we go. The last one we need. Heavy ship. Oh, darn it. Where am I? God dang it. I keep thinking I'm the blue one, but no, I'm the yellow one. Kill him! Kill him proper! Indeed, we, we did. And... Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, convenient! The thing broke off and flew off to where we had to go. Game okay, logic. Yep, let's go. I think this I don't is wanna. it. No. <laughs> no. 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 No, we're, we're going this way. No, nope, we are oh, not going to fall. Ethan, we forgot the last of the treasure. Quickly, we have to go back. <laughs> I just remembered we actually forgot it. Crap. No. It's blocked. Drat. <laughs> I forgot. Get back here so I can shock you, you little fur. <laughs> you little fur delinquent. <laughs> okay. All right. Where the hell have you been? <laughs> <laughs> I've been searching for a lady. Hey, Peter, I've been looking. Hey, Peter, I <laughs> hey, found this Peter. cool thing here. <laughs> Want to try it? It's called weed. <laughs> hey, Peter, I'm in a land with a bunch of magical creatures Hey, Peter. Now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Lava barf! Lava barf! That was one of my favorite. Oh, that was actually the... 
uh, commercial where they showed off uh, Pirate Sea, the Pirate Sea thing being put on the portal. But, and a rep is like, ships make me barf. And Gilgrath's like, well, that's good. Lava barf is your greatest ability. <laughs> and then he uses it in the low, and then everyone cheers, lava barf, lava, lava barf. barf. <laughs> My God, I think that this is, that I'm going to have to bring this up every time we're going to play this. Oh, Lord. Oh, well, I'll just make sure. I think we're done with the thing here. I'll just make sure to put these guys all away perfectly. I might have to get a separate uh, storage thing for my adventure pack things, though. That might be the smarter idea. Sure thing. All right, everybody. Thank you all for watching this episode of Bethel Park Gaming. Make sure you like and friend me on Bethel Park Gaming's Facebook page. Do not forget to subscribe to BPTV's and Bethel Park Gaming's YouTube pages. Until next time that we can do Skylanders with Colin and Ethan. Keep gaming. I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. Something just blew up. I said we will return with Skylanders and keep gaming. Eh? I said keep gaming. Keep flaming? Mm. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> <laughs>